Hello ladies and gentlemen of the internet webs, as you can see there's a package from Amazon here on my table and stuff and it has stuff in it, so let's open it and see what the stuff is, yay stuff, oh my god what is this, this is incredible, oh hello, oh it's the brand new Kid Icarus Uprising, it only came out Two and a half months ago. <laughs> Actually, I don't even remember when it came out, but it came out like something like that. I honestly don't have a clue when it came out, and I don't have a camera stand, so I'm just like freaking like doing all this noobish camera recording right here. So that's that's cool and stuff. But um, yeah, I have Kid Icarus. I just finished my exam today, so uh, I actually ordered this freaking frack on Amazon. Stay that I'm I should be the master of using a camera because I did do it for like three years of recording my Pokemon battles, so uh yeah I just pre-ordered this, uh not pre-ordered, but I did. I ordered it off Amazon so that it would arrive home before I got home. And it's here, which is cool, so might as well unbox it. I haven't done an unboxing in a while, I like unboxings. I I don't know why, but on the internet people seem to have this weird obsession with unboxing everything. Uh, but there you go. That's really blurry because my camera focus is terrible. It doesn't auto focus, like it only focuses on the one thing that you put it on, I guess. So, uh, we've got some stickers, malarkey here. So, let's freaking frick a frack our way through this and see if we can't get open. So, um, yeah, this is pretty cool, I guess. I'm probably going to be playing online once I bash through the single player. I don't know how long the single player will take. Uh, according to everyone, though, this game has, like, incredible replay value and, like, incredible amount of content for what you're getting. Um, I was pretty lucky because there was uh, an Amazon price drop on this. It went down to 20 quid from the usual, like, 30 that Amazon is selling it for, which is pretty awesome. Um, and then like a couple of days later it went straight back up to 30 again so I got in there when I was supposed to, ordered it, got the hell out of uh, a bad deal and got a good deal so now why the hell can't I open this man? Jesus Christ! I tell you I'm the worst box opener in the history of life I'm so, what the, okay maybe we should undo this sticker I'm gonna have to like fast forward through all this. You don't want to be watching me being a retarded, moronic, retarded. Yes, a retarded, moronic, retarded. Yes, I'm great at English. Absolutely stuck. Wow, crap! I'm tearing the box. Fuck! Look at that. That's the Nintendo official seal of of brilliance. I just fucking killed. Look at it. Now my product isn't gonna be, um, you know, secure with Nintendo's high standards, right? Oh, what's this? Oh, cool. Oh, you can flip out that. That's it's handy if you want to carry it around, sure. Uh, but for some reason, I can't seem. <laughs> I'm so bad at opening. Yes, yes. Oh, okay, I've got this pen. Pen, help me. Yes, pen. Yes, yes. You shall use the strength of the pen. Yes, the strength of the pen. Anyway, here we go. Here we go. Oh fucking. Uh, yes. Uh, <laughs> I should make another channel for unboxings. I should just call it like NBZ fails at unboxing shit because I generally do. There we go. Finally. Jesus Christ above. Uh, what kind of ridiculous packaging is this? Anyway, we've got, um, oh, that's cool. Yes, AR cards. Awesome. Um, if you didn't know, uh, I won a blog on IGN. Uh, it was the Nintendo blogger of the week like 67 people entered and I won for some reason because apparently I'm good at writing and uh, I won a download code on IGN but the problem was the download code was not uh, applicable to Europe so the European eShop basically didn't accept the American download code so what what I was offered instead was some exclusive Kid Icarus Uprising cards which obviously at that time I didn't have the game uh, and I was like okay well I guess that's probably a good substitute so they're gonna send me some exclusive Kid Icarus cards which you can only get at press events and stuff which is pretty awesome I think that to be perfectly honest that's probably more valuable to me than a, a 3DS download code anyway so I guess that worked out in the end but hey we're gonna get a, a pack here starter pack of cards let's see what we got first blade Oh man, everything sounds so badass in this. Let me see if I can focus them. I don't know if you can see that. Magnus, oh yes, he's like magnitude. Look at that name. Oh, it's Pit, he's Pit things. 
Oh my god, it's Cradley! I got a Cradley, yes! How much HP does it have? Oh, it doesn't tell me, damn it. Um, I got the bow of fortunes. And I got a, oh, I got a relicanth. Yeah, look at that. If you look at it that way, that looks like a relicanth, kind of. But it's actually that way, and it doesn't really. Uh, see, even if I like bring it close, it blurs. This annoys me a lot. But hey, that's what happens sometimes. Anyway, those are the cards. Those are pretty cool. That's for AR stuff. Um, you also get this badass motherfucker, which is the uh, the stand. It's cool. You, uh, I guess, you just like prop it up like that. Put your 3DS there, and then you uh, play like that. It's pretty cool. Stands up pretty nicely. Very solid. It's actually a lot smaller than I thought it would be. It's very compact. Uh, fits nicely. That's cool. And of course, the final package is the game itself, Kid Icarus Uprising. Uh, scored across the board universally very well. I think it's Metacritic of 83, so uh, generally people seem to like this game a lot. Uh, obviously, lots of complaints about the control mechanism, but I, for one, tend to uh, veer on the edge of... Uh, you know, uh, the control mechanism being both a blessing and a curse because, like, it's so necessary because of the fast-paced movement of the game, but it's also a bit of a hindrance just because you have to use, like, a fucking claw grip to get it. Uh, the thing I like about these 3DS uh, cases is they, they have these little holes with, like, pictures in it. It's pretty cool. Uh, but there you go. Uh, there's my pin for my Club Nintendo, which I'm not going to share with you because I want that. And then there's some random basic control crap. Another thing and a the other thing. Oh look, there's Palatina and all her faces there. That's the thing I like about these 3DS uh, cover slider things. So it's cool. Um, so yeah, there you go. That's it. That's pretty much it. Let's take out the uh, cartridge itself. Oh, there we go. The cartridge. Which, uh, so you can't even blur. You know what? This is stupid. But you can. You get the idea. You get the idea, people. It's Kid Icarus and you stuff with it. Uh, so there. Yeah, that's Kid Icarus Uprising, uh, I will most likely be playing that online, so if you do want to play Kid Icarus, then I will probably, uh, uh, if you want to like my Facebook page, I will most likely tell you when I'm going to play Kid Icarus online on my Facebook page, so I'll leave the Facebook link in the description, as always, all my links are always in the description, Twitter and Facebook and whatever, um, but Facebook's the one I'm probably most active on, and I always tell people if I'm playing Mario Kart online on my Facebook, I always tell people if I'm playing Kid, I'll, I will tell people if I'm playing Kid Icarus on, ah, online when I'm on my Facebook, so go and do that stuff, and life should be fun and things. Uh, otherwise, I'll see you guys with the next battle or whatever the hell I upload next. I don't know, I just upload whatever the hell I like these days. I'll see you guys then.